life. Uh, it's all volunteer run. Uh, I volunteer for this, but my full time job is a vocal coffee, a vocal coffee, a vocal coffee. Mm -hmm. And um, anyways, <laughs> nobody watches these. Seriously, we have three views, and that's my girlfriend. She just keeps watching them. Huh? I miss him. Love you, Suzanne. That's a shout out. <laughs> Suzanne Gracie, hey. Okay, so <laughs> I feel like you hear their name in the internet world. No, but anyway, um, big news today, guys. Um, yeah, another day in the neighborhood. How was y'all's day? It's kind of cool, you know, big news. Yeah, it's whatever. Grant, anything cool? It's whatever. Yeah, Grant's kind of a nihilist like that. Yeah. <laughs> whatever. Oh, no, I'm just kidding. It's not just whatever. Whoa, my voice is a naturally in a B flat. That's kind of neat. Little known fact. Hey guys, welcome. Are y'all are y'all into alcohol? No, I don't drink either. Been one year clean, everybody. Hey, Great. clean. It's one of me. I'm just kidding. Thank you. No, I never really had a problem with it. You know, I've always kind of been. Lucky. You know, yeah, I was always kind of been. Uh, you know, just kind of one toe man. <laughs> but um, I guess so it's easy to quit. So anyway, I suggest everybody, you know, kind of search your heart and think. Hey, you know, I could probably. Probably cut that out of my life and feel a lot better. Whether it's sugar, tobacco, sex, I don't know. There's all kinds of things to be addicted to. But uh, that's my encouraging moment. And that's been an encouraging moment brought to you by Dreamy Life Records. No, but uh, yeah, no, I encourage you guys to change your life and, and do something healthy for yourself because I did that and, and I feel great. But up since 5.30 a.m., normally, you know, in the past, that would have like, <laughs> that would have made me go to sleep. And by the way, that that just is kind of different ways to R2D2 myself into an actual droid. Yeah, I know, it's this dream of mine. So, you too can dream the highest dreams of being enjoyed. Guys, um, I'm actually working on a new song for Starbase. You can see it at the future event. That's right, mm. at, at sign future event. That was brought to you by the Future Event. I don't know if you guys know, but I'm on the Future Event marketing board, uh, advertising board, and it's really cool because um, it's the place to be on New Year's. If you don't have any New Year's plans, that's where you gotta be. It's gonna be awesome. There's gonna be a complete decontamination unit before you walk in, and you get like an ID, oh. and cool, it's like you're getting shipped off to Mars. Neat. And then you walk down this hallway, and then it's like, the future. Exactly like that. No, seriously, we were talking about it in the in the pregame. Uh, a lot of really talented people are involved. Um, some of them, some of my favorite in the city. Uh, I don't want to shout out to uh, too many people, but um, God. <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, that was a little yeah, shout out yeah, there. Yeah. Right, uh, or girl, we don't know yet. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so uh, the the verdict is out, and you can go ahead and comment down below with your ideas and whatever. Okay, no hate, okay? We don't like that here. That's right, uh, this is all about the love, love of the music, love of the scene, love of art, love of your community, love of your neighbor. Uh, everything happens at this at this place, and then, um, I don't know if you can feel it, but I can feel it in here. Like, every time I walk in, you're like, oh, I'm, I'm at home, and you know, there's so many cool friendships and relationships that start here, and um, it don't really end, it's a lifetime. The library's a lifetime away from you. That's right. I sing a lot uh, just to kind of keep the creative juices flowing. And you too, by calling now my five-star plan, you can achieve Zen like Buddhist <laughs> enlightenment through books. Anyway, the first book's only $25. So you just call now and send me a check. Go ahead and comment below. You know, I like to say that. I know everybody does that. You know, on the videos you watch, you're like, how do I do this? And then they're like, this is how you do it. Go ahead and comment below if you like my video. <laughs> right? <laughs> Go ahead and comment below if you like the video of Rose doing yoga. Hey. Shout out, shout out right over here. Hey guys, if you've got a family, you can come on up here every Friday night in the Fairmount neighborhood of Dream of where are we? Okay, Fort Worth, Texas, <laughs> south south of the highway. Coming to a community library near you, Dreamy Life. The next year is big deal. We got a lot of things. Grant, you have anything? Pitch in on the um, on your front, your promotional front. Grant Baird, everybody. Yeah. From, what is your what is your promotion thing called? I forgot. Okay. Well, if you want to talk to Grant about promoting some stuff, he's the guy. Public Street. If you're in a band, need a show. H and U. HMU, hit hit him up. Hit me and him up. Hit hit H U U. 
All right? Anyway, thank you guys. Uh, I, I kind of think I'm funny, but I don't know. We'll just yeah. kind of, but thank you. Thank you for joining us. Okay, for my next trick. Hey, and it's still there. It's good. Thank you, everybody. I did that one time for <laughs> for these people at Avoca, you know, and like I think they were from out of town. I don't know if they're from like Kansas or Nebraska. It was some like Midwestern state. I forget what it was, but they were here for like the college game, and these people had never seen that trick before. And I was like, doo, 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 doo. and I swear, like they had seen some devils or <laughs> in action, you know. I mean, everybody was just. I mean, grown adults were just <laughs> floored by it. And I'm like, what? Are you kidding? Like, what? So, that was, that happened. Uh, keep practicing, Gracie. You're going to get it. But, uh, that's like the coolest magic trick. That, like, when I, was, when I found that as a kid, like, hey, cool. Yeah, like, there it is. It's just like the coolest thing. Hi. See, see, I'm getting some, I'm getting some mad love from the kids' room. Yeah, yeah. Hey, shout out everybody in the kids' room. Hey. hey. Boom, 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 boom. That's right, folks. This is a party here. Like, I mean, you don't even have to like alcohol. I don't like alcohol, but there's some here if you need it. I'm trying to get maybe some kombucha donated somehow, or maybe like make a bunch of it for this. Yes. I think I need to get in on that, Grant. And you can get on that too with the healthy life. My 12 week program will have you hosting shows at a community library near you. Thank you. So, um, oh, Cameron Smith is here, everybody. That's a cool thing. Another thing about watching these videos is just kind of seeing who rolls in as you're watching. You're just like, you never know what's going to happen. This is a community center for everyone. So, guys, this is the part of the show. Uh, <laughs> okay, that was the X Files moment. Thank you. Thank you very much. I've watched it so many times, I can just do it. Here we go. So, um, I'm actually working on a jazz kind of. You know, the synth comes in. Like, I'm working on that. Check out my SoundCloud. Uh, SoundCloud. Anyway, I don't really have one yet. Um, Starbase, though. Hey, little selfless promotion. We're saying shameless. Excuse me. Not selfless at all. Um, <laughs> Yeah, we have a band camp, check that out. So anyway, um, this is the part of the show when you know I either get alien conspiracy kind of weird or um, or I, I, I don't know, we just kind of talk about cool, fun things, just ideals. Last time we got a call from uh, the president himself. Uh, we've gotten a call from Arnold before. Um, I think what Alec Baldwin called one time. I think that wasn't that? That was kind of cool. Um, but you never know. I mean, we got reports of aliens in Fort Worth. You know, you don't know what's going to happen. But um, I think I'm, I think I'm, I'm use the time that I normally talk about aliens to just encourage y'all, everybody here, to um, go to a show that you don't know anybody on the on the roster and just listen to a couple sets and, and give them some love because that is the easiest way that you can support art and music in the city. And then most likely or not, one of those guys in the band is an artist and probably will. Something. <laughs> so if you really want to go, you can get two birds with one stone. Commission some cool stuff. Okay. No, but uh, what's one of my favorite things? I consider myself a patron of the arts, and is to inspire people who maybe you know I want to draw, but I just don't have any pencils. Like, man, let's go get some pencils. You know, hey, if it what is it? Twenty five dollars. Is that the reason that you're not drawing? And then saying, hey, show me what you can do, and really trying to push that. And I think uh, more could be done with the kids. As far as like instruments go, you know, I'd love to maybe in the future down the line do some kind of cool, uh, you know, hey, giving instruments to kids who may not have had that opportunity. Because uh, whether you're involved or not, uh, we're all progressing the future. It's all, and so you can seed it with love or hate or nothing or give your heart. And so that I, I believe in giving and giving and giving. And so um, you two can give by calling now. <laughs> The number below, please call. <laughs> Your real number, right? Yeah, we're putting my number on there because I'm just like in the RV, like, bloop, bloop. like who's this? It's either Avoca or Dreamy Life. Oh, you want to talk? Let's talk beverage. <laughs> oh no, you're gonna talk to Ravi about that. I can't give you prices. Oh, you want 10%? Oh, I'm sorry, that's gonna happen. 
Jim Valley has a strict no, uh, yeah, confidentiality agreement clause. Okay. <laughs> You're gonna need to talk to his attorney. You want to lawyer up? Let's go. This is at like three in the morning, and I'm in the RV, and like I gotta work in the morning. Anyway, kids just said that he's really funny. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that <laughs> Elisa, Elisa Burns, another patron of the arts here in Fort Worth. I don't think I can remember a warehouse show where you weren't there and just like oh, yeah. adamantly involved. I just. I can't think of the warehouse without seeing you in my mind and just being like, yes. Mm -hmm. So, cheers to you. Uh, and cheers to Jim Valley over here. I don't know if you can see him on the on the uh, steady cam. There he is. Hey. Amen. He's, he's just the, the man of music. You know what I mean? The, uh, when you think of music in Fort Worth, you just think Jim Valley. You know? Spinning them hits. Spinning the hits from the racks and the stacks to the best on wax. Jim Valley is boss. <laughs> So Sam, you ready, bud? You ready to do this? Yeah. Sam Anderson. So we actually looked that song up. It's Alan Parsons Project, and it's from Chicago Bulls like walk up. I don't know if you guys remember that, yeah, that yeah. time in your life when everybody was a Bulls fan. I don't know. We all were Bulls like, fans. I mean, like it was just like Michael Jordan. It'll be, it'll be good. Okay. Everybody. I mean, like, how could you? How could you root against him? You know, you're like, oh, I feel sorry for that team. You know, you're like, oh, they're they're playing those guys. Well, anyway, thank you guys for being here. My name's Pete Gillen. Donate to that jar back there. All that money goes to Sam. We don't ask for anything for the beer. Shout out to RAR for their continued beer patronage. Uh, shout out to uh, Collective Brewing Project for continually hosting our DJ nights and, and being a great supporter of us and, and us them. Uh, another shout out to any, what do we have shows tonight? Anything? We'll, think, we'll get back to you. The post-game show, we're going to talk all about it. We're going to talk about Sam's performance. We're going to interview him. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> yeah, we're going to get John Madden in here. He's going to just like, boom, to back to connect it. Okay. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Sam Anderson.
This is all volunteer run. Thank you for joining us. Uh, please donate to the bu the bucket back there that goes to Sam. Next week, where we got Jacob Fur Christmas. Is that next yeah, week? Yeah. yeah. We're having our furry Christmas, and you too can be here. We got Jacob Fur right in the middle. We're going to drape him in garland, and it's just going to be a jolly old time. So maybe we might have Santa himself join us. So you can join us too in all the fun here at Dreaming Life Records. Ford were prohibited by law. Anyway, uh, <laughs> thank you guys uh, again. Thank you to everybody. Robbie and Jen Rocks, uh, Cameron Smith, Stephanie Donahue, uh, Peter Marsh, um, who, Chandler Burns. Uh, who else am I missing? Uh, there's got to be more. Jim, Jim Valley. The, we, we gave him a big old spot earlier. Uh, thank you, everybody, uh, for being here tonight. A big show afterward. Where are we going? What's going on? Anything? Hey, what's going on tonight? Jim, what's the next thing? What are we plugging? Hey, yeah. shout out to our, our beloved on Cody Soap. Hey, Cody it's your birthday, buddy, and this one's for you. And I believe you. Hey. And I believe you. Cody Soap. You know you're playing video games somewhere tonight. Working at Barcadia. Hey. <laughs> that was for you, Cody. Thank you so much. And thank you to everybody in the room. Dream Life Records, Pete Gillen, signing out for another Dream Life Records happy hour. Thank you so much. It's the loneliest time of day.